So uh, I realized that um, even though I'm super active on Instagram and other sites, I'm not as active as I can be on the YouTube. So um, I want to show off the massive gelatinous cubes. Uh, if you haven't seen them, they were on Kickstarter last year, and um, they just delivered here, and were almost completely shipped them all out. So here we are. Um, these suckers are huge. They are 51 millimeter or two inches across. And I'll kind of I'll put the camera down a little bit on this sweet fucking dungeon tile thing. You can see how massive they are. Here's an average mini. These are some cool Simon minis, and they just tower over these dudes. So this is this is the first one we did green with red ink and people responded to them really well but they were like man we really want white ink on these green baddies. So um, last minute we talked to the manufacturer and they let us do white ink with the green. So we only we had a very 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 limited number of those. I think only 1300 shipped um, with the first first order. And we're quickly selling out of these. Along with the green, we made red with white ink. You can see very Christmas, Christmas holiday colors here. Uh, these are pretty badass. Also 51 millimeters. Really capture the light. You can see like straight through these crazy beasts. Absolutely love them. So if you didn't know, Massive Gelatinous, um, they're dice, obviously, and they can function as minis because in, you know, an average RPG tabletop game, um, two by two by two inches is ten by ten feet, and uh, you can use these guys as giant minis. But then also they are impractical giant dice. The skulls being the pips or dots. That's side four, side six, side three. I have a kind of witcher sword in there. Got one of the witcher. Side two. Side five. Did I miss? I probably missed a side. I can't remember. Side one. Chock full of stuff. So this is the first edition, Massive Gelatinous. Um, three different versions. We also had uninked versions. I have those somewhere. Um, but you can just imagine they have no ink and uh, people can paint their own. Those have been fairly popular as well. And then we also did small versions that you can, they are, you can roll these guys. They roll, they roll pretty well actually. Here, let's do four. You can do, I don't have the biggest hands in the world and I can do four. Not a bad roll. Um, same colors. They're just, uh, what, an eighth of the size? So um, 25 millimeter or one inch across. And... That these are also the first edition. So, amazing, great campaign, sold a ton of them, and we're going to keep the product line going. Um, I, will, I will reveal in the next video the new ones that are even more evil and cool. We're definitely um, giving them an upgrade. And we do. I do plan on making more of these. These have been really popular, and some more of these are coming in. We had a whole case of these get smashed, so a few backers are still waiting on these, and I super apologize for that. Uh, it's heartbreaking because no one wants to play, no one likes to see product get destroyed. Um, so we are going to order some more of these, but right now they're super rare. These are running out. Uh, it's been really, it's really super fun. Let me tilt the camera back up. Um, but yeah, uh, massive gelatinous by Severed Books, which is just me in my basement, Justin. Love you.